Chapter One. The Nursery. Wendy, John, and Michael Darling live in a lovely house in London. They have got a big sunny nursery. There are colourful pictures and a big clock on the wall. There are toys here and there. The Darlings are a happy family. Mr. Darling and Mrs. Darling love their children very much. Wendy is the first child. John is the second, and Michael is the third. The children's nanny is called Nana, and she's a big Newfoundland dog. Her kennel is in the nursery, and she is a wonderful nanny. She loves the children, and the children love her. One evening, Mister and Missus Darling want to go to a dinner party. They have their best clothes on. Nana, it's time to put the children to bed," says Missus Darling. Nana goes to the bathroom. She turns on the hot water for Michael's bath. She puts her paw in the water to check the temperature. It's perfect. I don't want to have a bath," says little Michael. But Nana is a firm nanny, and Michael has his bath. Then Nana gives the children their pajamas. Now they're ready for bed. Mrs. Darling comes into the nursery and smiles. Good work, Nana. I see the children are ready for bed. Nana wags her big tail. Suddenly. There's a noise. Mrs. Darling sees a young boy outside the nursery window. She's very surprised. <coughs> Nana barks and shuts the window quickly. The boy's shadow falls on the floor. The young boy flies away. Who's there? asks Mrs. Darling. She opens the window and looks outside. But she sees nothing. Then she sees the boy's shadow on the floor and says, "Poor boy, this is his shadow. Let's put it in the drawer." The children are in bed. Mister Darling takes Nana to the garden. Then he goes to the sitting room and waits for Missus Darling. Missus Darling sings to the children, "La la 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 la." And kisses them. She's a perfect mother. Soon the three children are sleeping. Mister and Missus Darling go to their bedroom. They put on their coats and go to the dinner party.